Hello and welcome to the graduation workshop for the College of Health and Human Services. We are the graduation coaches for the College of Health and Human Services Advising and Career Development Center. My name is Mai Lee and here I also have... Hello everyone, my name is Lupe Tapia. So this workshop provides information for incoming and future undergraduate seniors. Graduation requirements. A minimum of 120 units total is required to meet graduation standards. Students must meet their major requirements and complete their general education courses, which includes foundation, breadth, integration, multicultural and or international courses. Students must also have upper division writing skills completed, pass the upper division writing examination depending on major or pass their writing course with a grade of C or higher. Students must also have their residence units completed. A minimum of 30 units must be taken in residence with at least 24 upper division, 12 in the major, and 9 in general education. A minimum of 40 upper division units and a GPA of 2.0 or higher in the three areas of their major, all Fresno State coursework, and total cumulative units. Some majors will require a C or better in every class. Finally, file graduation application during specified filing periods. Degree Progress Report, known as DPR. So what is the Degree Progress Report? The DPR shows a student's progress in a chosen degree program using courses taken at Fresno State and at transfer institutions. The report displays how courses applied toward the student's declared major, general education, degree requirements, and displays a list of approved courses for each remaining requirement. So how do, how do you request a DPR? You log into my Fresno State, click Student Self-Service under my menu, click Student Center, select my academic records and registration, and select Degree Progress Self-Service. Here's a small video on how to request a DPR and how your DPR looks. Hello and welcome to this video tutorial on how to run your DPR. To request a degree progress report, you'll need to log into your My Fresno State portal. Click the sign in button, enter your email ID and password, and click login. Under My Menu, select Student Self Service, followed by Student Center. Under My Academic Records and Registration, you'll need to select Degree Progress Self Service. Once you have selected Degree Progress Self-Service from your Fresno State portal, you will be directed to the following page where you will have the option to select from either an HTML or a PDF report. You can also select from a detailed or a senior Degree Progress report. A detailed DPR will provide you with an overview of all your degree requirements, including courses already completed, in progress, and any deficient areas. A senior DPR allows you to see only the areas that will be completed with in-progress coursework and any deficient areas. Once you select your options, click Run Audit to begin generating the DPR. Notice that this symbol will let you know that the DPR is still running. After the DPR is done running, you'll need to click on View Audit to view the audit in HTML or to download the audit if PDF format was selected. Note that within this page, you will have access to delete old DPRs if you no longer wish to see them. Once you are able to view your degree progress report, you'll need to pay close attention to both the major and the catalog year, which are listed at the top of the DPR. If you need to change either of these, you'll need to visit the Admissions and Records Office in the Joyal Administration Building. Of special importance is the catalog year because you'll want to make sure it's listed correctly since the catalog year determines the requirements a student must complete to receive a baccalaureate degree. The HTML version of the DPR will default to open all sections, but you have the option to close all sections and determine which ones you want to view. The DPR is organized in the following order. Major, including major GPA, additional major requirements if required, 
general education, including any excess GE, other degree requirements, electives, and a chronological summary of all coursework attempted or completed, including cumulative GPA. To better understand and decode your DPR, look for the following symbols. A green check mark indicates the area is complete. A blue rectangle indicates the area will be completed with successful completion of in-progress courses. A red X indicates a deficient area, usually requiring either completion of a specific course or courses, or clearance from the appropriate department or committee. The legend can be found by hovering your mouse over the information bubble. Please pay special attention to any codes next to your classes. Certain codes mean credit is being removed for the course. I hope this training video has been helpful to you and given you a clearer sense of what a DPR is and what it's used for on this campus. Graduating with honors. To graduate with honors, students must have a campus and cumulative GPA of 3.5 or higher. Students must have an overall minimum grade point average of 3.5 or higher on all work attempted. Students must also have a minimum grade point average on all work taken at CSU Fresno, must have completed 45 units in residence at CSU Fresno, grade point average earned at California State University Fresno determines which, honor, which honors you will receive. Here is a list of the three honors honored at Fresno State. We have the Summa Cum Laude, Highest Honors, Magna Cum Laude, High Honors, and Cum Laude, Honors. Diploma. Diplomas are not granted automatically when students complete degree requirements. Students must buy an application for graduation on their last semester which intend to complete all degree requirements. Two ways to apply for graduation. Apply online through myfresnostate.edu and pay the $35 non-refundable filing fee or go to the cashier's window located at the Joy Administration and pay also the $35 non-refundable filing fee. The table on the right side of this slide shows the different deadlines for applying for graduation depending on your planned graduation date. Your official diplomas will be sent through mail. Commencement. The university honors all graduating students upon completion. Commencement ceremony have individual convocations to honor their graduates. Some events require tickets, so please check carefully. Some require to pay a fee depending on ceremony. St students can participate in commencement if they only have few classes short or completing degree requirements. Students have completed a minimum of 100 units during their senior status, have established a 2.0 GPA or higher, and are currently enrolled in a California State University Fresno program. Please visit the Degree Advising Office in Joyal Administration Room 115 during the first few, four weeks of the spring semester. Students, also please note that you will not graduate with a degree or receive your diploma until you have applied for, for a degree and all degree requirements are completed. Degree Checklist. Meet with Advising and Career Development Center Advisor for G Advising. Meet with Major Advisor for Major Advising. Apply for graduation. File your degree application and pay the the 35 non-refundable filing fees by using the online undergraduate degree checkout process through your student center. Apply for undergraduate degree. After you apply, your application will be reviewed. The degree advising office will send you an email to your Fresno State email account with your graduation status. Students receiving a bachelor degree and intending to continue for post-bachelor or graduate study at Fresno State must reapply for admission at CSU Mentor and pay the, the non-refundable application fee. Here we also have a graduation checklist prior to graduation. Let me point out the four semesters prior to graduation. 
Meet with your academic advisor to monitor your academic progress toward graduation. Be sure you are aware of the courses you still need to take and, will, and when they are offered. Some courses are only offered in the fall or spring semester, so please plan accordingly. Complete the upper division writing skills requirement after 60 units and or before 90 units. Apply for a career-related job, internship, or community service. Develop a working relationship with at least three faculty members. These individuals will be invaluable when you need letters of recommendation in the future. If considering a graduate or professional school, begin researching possible schools. If considering a pre-professional path, make an appointment to meet with a pre-professional advisor. Contact the University Advising Center for a current list. Study for appropriate interest exams and attend the Career and Intern Expo. The semester you plan to graduate. Apply for graduation. Be sure to submit your graduation application during the posted filing period, which is usually at the start of the semester in which you intend to complete all degree requirements. Meet with your academic advisor. If you have received educational loans, attend the mandatory financial aid exit interview workshop. Contact the financial aid office. Clear any financial obligations to the university. Don't know if you have any? Check the account summary, linking your student portfolio at myfresnostate.edu. If considering a career employment following graduation, update your personal resume and cover letter. Continue employment interviews. Attend job fairs and select the commencement ceremonies in which you would like to participate during the month of May. Attend the grad fair. Be sure to purchase your grad pack, cap and gown, graduation announcements, and learn, learn more about the Fresno State Alumni Association. Schedule your graduation portraits and purchase your class ring. Make hotel reservations for family and friends for graduation weekend. Update your address and other contact information in your personal portfolio at myfresnostate.edu. And order an official transcript for your records. Be sure you request that it be sent after your degree is posted. Congratulations on all you have accomplished. Career and Internship Expo. Fresno State will be holding their Spring 2017 Career and Internship Expo on March 15th from 1.30 to 5 p.m. held at the Save Mars Center. Did you know excellent interpersonal skills are in top demand by employers today? Practice these skills or showcase your talent at this event. Don't miss this opportunity to meet with representatives from organizations seeking candidates to fill full-time, part-time, internship, and entry-level career positions. Employers use career fairs to promote their opportunities and to pre-screen applicants. Career fairs are networking events that allow students the opportunity to meet potential employers. Prepare for your career fair and get your materials together. Update your resume and bring 30 copies nicely printed on resume paper. Make sure your clothes are cleaned and ironed. Leave your backpack at home, dress professionally, be prepared to ask and answer questions. After the fair, send thank you emails to all employers to whom you spoke and follow through on submitting any information that you promised. Always keep the hiring process in mind. Students graduating spring 2017 attend the 14th annual Grad Fest. It will be held March 21st from 10 a.m. to 7 p.m and March 22nd from 9 a.m. to 2 p.m. The location will be at the Memorial Garden grass area in front of the Candle Bookstore. Order your 2017 grad box by March 10. Your grad box costs $80. Your 2017 grad box includes your cap, gown, and tassel, your Fresno State Alumni Chrome license plate frame, an exclusive Bulldog for Life t-shirt, one-of-a-kind alumni decal, Bulldog for Life, alumni stainless steel water bottle, and an official alumni pop pin. Workshops and events. Here is a list of the Career Development Center's Spring 2017 schedule. The purpose of these workshops are to help students explore career options and build their resumes and or personal statements. Additionally, the Career Development Center has a clothing closet available to students open during office hours. University Commencement Ceremony. 
Congratulations, class of 2017. Save the date, Saturday, May 20, 2017, where at the Save Mar Center. University commencement ceremony timeline. Doors open for guest seating at 8 in the morning. Graduates arrive for lineup at 8 in the morning. Processional starts at 9.30 in the morning and ceremony starts at 10 a.m. in the morning. If you have any questions, please do not hesitate to contact us in McLean Hall, room 194. We can also be reached by phone at 559-278-5027 or by mail at acdc at csufresno.edu. Thank you and congratulations.